Hey everybody, I'm Modi Apparatus and welcome to a look at a game called The Red Lantern. This game was announced a while back and it looked really cool, kind of this dog sled survival game. Um, and it is, it is that. It says it's a resource management narrative game where you and your team of five sled dogs must survive the wilderness. And it seemed like it's really cool. Similar vein is like long dark or something like that, but, um, sled dogs. Who doesn't love sled dogs? Uh, this was recommended to me by Fixer actually, so thank you to him for recommending it. It is on Epic Game Store. It is on sale right now. You can also get the Epic Game Store coupon for the holiday time right now. So you get uh, $10 off anything over $20, which this would qualify for that. So it brings the price down to, I think, about 9 bucks after all said and done. So that's pretty cool. Um, it came out back in October. I didn't get a chance to look at it then. We'll take a look at it now, see what we think about it, and uh, see if it's worth your time. Let's find out what it's all about with the brand new game. First of all, I want to say I went into the journal here. And it looked really cute. It's got a to-do. Get dogs, get sled, go to Alaska, finish dog sled race. It's written in crayon. I don't know why it's written in crayon, but maybe this person had this journal for a long time. Then we have the to-do revised. So they started, they bought one journal throughout their life. They started as a child, about five years old, bought this one journal. Then they didn't use any other pages. Started to-do revised, get van, bring camper, adopt a dog team, go to Alaska. All that stuff is checked off the list. Hop on sled, first step to musher, figure it out find a new home so this person has not done this before and then if we go into this we have a bunch of checklists here we have make a plan imagine the new neighbors you'll have all the beauty you'll see don't be afraid to explore be, but be prepared for the worst case too. pay attention to everything be excited by the small things and the big ones too you're out here learning find the new you packing list we got dog sled van food wood bullets med pack i just this so this person has this person done this before or not that's my question here see the narrative beauty one who is lost is never found is never lost is never found hanging with fluffy friends living off the land i don't know this seems like a, a story of a novice person going into the dog sled situation here and totally unprepared for is what it, so it sounds like to me thinking it's it's gonna be easy it's gonna get them and their whole dog team killed is what i'm thinking here we'll see what happens do you have those moments that just stick out in your mind those ones that just stay with you forever when I was a kid, I was told, you are what you do, so choose wisely. And I tried to choose doctor, but that didn't take. This voice actor sounds super familiar. I can still hear him. I'm gonna have to look it up later. You know, this, this just isn't for you. But I knew what they meant. This just isn't you. So I can look around. For you as a buddy. Puppy. Chomper. Hey, puppy. World's Chomper. Best pup ah, friend. Chomper. Chaser of squirrels. Smeller of city streets. I like and Chomper. Chewer of literally everything. <laughs> See, you know exactly who you are. He's got it all figured out. Oh, oh there's a, there's a little checklist here. Van, sled, dogs. Plan, check, huh? check, check. Oh my gosh. I haven't exactly made the best decisions lately, <laughs> except for adopting you, of course you I'd be pretty lost and I sure as hell wouldn't be out on this road in the middle of nowhere Alaska huh but we needed a fresh start and I've dreamed of dog sledding since I was a kid Marco made the races sound incredible <sighs> this is and gonna be bad you drag me <laughs> up and down the streets of San Francisco I think you have dog racing dreams too wait you're racing well, you're doing dog racing in San Francisco team, huh chomper we need four more pups to start training you don't have all the dogs yet? Oh, hey! We just passed mile marker 32! So, the ad said that just after the mile marker, there would be a kennel with a dog sledding veteran we could adopt. Figure we can check out the pup, maybe add some experience to our team. What do you think? This seems like a terrible idea. Uh, especially since we're a bit new, you've always wanted a best friend. Let's find someone that compliments your squirrel hunting obsessions. Maybe a calmer pup? This seems like a terrible idea! Why is she doing this? Igloo. Where are you, girl? Iggy. That's great. Oh, she blended right in. That's so good. You know you have a house right there. You don't have to be in the snow. She likes the snow. I, okay, I'm like wondering what the fringe is there. It's my hood. I have a hood up. That's awesome. I love that detail. You just a big old snowball. Big, fluffy, loud. Quality qualities we need. 
We got a doggy. So your owner said you're ready for an adventure. You love being out in the wild. But they've grown too old for the risks of what's out there. Hmm. Well, I think we can make this happen. Did you tell them you're a novice I've completely to this? Start. Can you help protect us? It'll be an adventure for all of us. Be, right? You only get nervous when you're doing something new. Let's awaken those nerves. This is just, just a few more miles to our next stop. We're looking for three more pups to fill out our team and help us get to our new home. Oh boy. Gail. You look like a force to be reckoned with. Gail. Oh, is it energetic doggy. I don't think you'll be needing much motivation. You <laughs> might need more than a nudge in the right direction, but looks like you'll set your sights on a destination and get there. I'll probably have to make sure you take some time to rest so we can keep this energy up. Uh, do you want to join the team? Or I don't know if I can manage you. Oh, should we say no to a dog? Sorry, puppy. I'm not sure I'm ready for you. One day, I hope I am. Are we going to get other dogs to look at? Oh, we're going to drive some more? We're going to have like Just on a, a full team. more miles to our next stop. We're looking for three more pups to fill out our team. Okay, interesting. So we're building a bodega. Uh, I love bodega. Did you move your house here? I don't have any snacks. Oh, two tone eyes. Why didn't I bring snacks? That's pretty common in husky. Said he's that been thing. eating them out of house and home. Well, it's a big eater, but he's a big dog. Bodega is so fun. Uh, it's a hungry boy though, but he's a big dog, strong dog. Yeah, I think he'll be a great addition to the team. Need some meat on this team. Let's go. All right, so we got a big, tough, hungry dog. Okay, it's gonna I take more food. He's so food big. Us, but that's part of the adventure, right? We're gonna find our food. We're yeah, find our food. Oh my God, this is a terrible Just idea. Just imagine it. No, I'm imagining we're gonna, we're gonna have the heaviest sled. We'll catch what we need when we need it. We'll live a life that's not wasteful. We'll be in control of everything and only take what we need Wishful thinking. when we need it. We'll keep your belly from grumbling, and you can help carry us all home. We only have to worry about ourselves out here. A big reset button for all of us. We get to start something new. Become oh my God. someone new. I feel like this I'll seems so ill-advised. Why are you doing this, lady? She believes in herself. At least she does right now. This and is so you, bad. That's why you're part of the team. Not that the okay, story's so far, bad. So good. Two pups out of the three stops is a great start. We only need Not to like adopt a... two more dogs, and we have five more stops. I think we'll be okay. Not like uh, two more dogs and five more stops. Okay. Um. Barkley. Oh, you're not a small <gasps> fella, are you? Oh, he's little. They said you were big, but oh, you're big. gonna make Chomper look like he was mixed with a corgi. You're actually kind of intimidating. I right. like that. It sounds like you've gotten into a few fights out there in the wilderness and that you always stuck by your musher's side but they were afraid you would jump into a fight you couldn't win oh and i now like you've him become restless being stuck back in the kennel howling at night for the wild you can't get to i like him well we're hopefully going to have a nice training run out to a new home we'll see plenty of wild things i'm sure and i'd like to avoid the fights i can't win too yeah i think this could be good for both of us. Yeah, we want a fighter. We need some right. fighters on the team. We got a similar A team. Barkley, yes, join our team. We got our fighter, we got our our tough guy, you know, our our carrier. I'm not really sure why they call you Barkley. You haven't made a single sound since I met you. See, it's Bark. Should we give you a new name? Something no. that reflects your quiet nature? Moose slippers. Snoozers. Moose. Mouse sounds nice. Mouse, right? oh, mouse, not moose. <laughs> There's Bark. a you there. Okay. Wait, now he barks. So, uh, not okay. quiet, just one to pick your moments. I will make sure to listen. So let's keep barking. <laughs> I like that we don't get to change the name. It's fantastic. Yeah, good. Good, Barkley. Adopting dogs is so easy. So easy, I yes. I just love all of you. This the seems, okay. almost complete, and I've only met a few dogs. We've got four it's more stops It's not that the game is bad. It's not that the game is bad. That when, I say, when I say this is so bad, I'm like in a, like a noodle. noodle. Huh? <laughs> I can see that. I said I like running it. alone wasn't enough for you. You were looking for some kind of challenge and a musher who'd listen to you too. 
Well, I don't really know what I'm doing, so uh, <sighs> having some help out there might be nice. Puppy. <laughs> okay, when I say this is so bad, I'm not talking about the writing. The writing is fantastic. The dialogue is fantastic. The voice acting is so fantastic so far. The dogs are amazing. Everything about this game has been so cool so far. I'm just like, this is like a don't go into the basement kind of like when you're watching a horror movie. Like, don't go in the basement. Why are you going to the basement? Don't go in the wilderness ill-prepared taking five dogs with you, which will lead to their death. Why are you doing this? This seems so ill-advised and terrible that you're trying to like force your new life upon all these poor puppies. I feel bad for the puppies is what I feel bad for. Her, her, not so much, I guess. It's just so bad to take puppies with you when you wanted to go out in a blaze of glory here. Okay, you sound perfect. You just lay on the ground? Let's see. He still like to run, right? I promise we'll Does still get plenty Does he have legs? <laughs> you look ready for make sure just know that paused. I still have to make the calls and try to do what's best for us will that work for you um welcome to the ready team to go meet the rest of the new team he's a sad he's a sad older puppy it seems like well welcome to the van this is chomper he's a city pup but he's city ready to pup. get out there and learn how to become a sled dog you ready to help us train? It sounds like you weren't too big a fan of indecision last time you raced. So you decided which way to go if your driver didn't? Oh, and that good! I should trust you when I'm not sure what's best. I can work with that. Well, I'm more than willing to defer to you if your instincts are sharp. Oh my god. I trust that you're a smart pup, Noodle. And I need help with more than running. But you can't just lay down in the middle of the trail, okay? We've got a new life to start. <sighs> and once we're home, I'll build you a nice little den with a perfect nap zone. Well, you gotta run How's still. That you can't adopt dogs and make them go all sit right, at home then. Right. Rest up. We've got plenty of running ahead of us. You gotta do this all the time now. You got, you're a, you're a musher now. We're really about to do this. You're not. We've got an incredible team here, and all that's left for us is to head out to our new home. This is a lot of responsibility to take on. Five dogs to take care for in an environment you're not familiar with. Oh my god. The Red Lantern. Oh man. It looks good, though. It's got a good look to it. It's got a good premise. It's just like, mm, I don't know, man. I can't believe we made it to Alaska Chomper. Margo Pups. said to travel to the end of the road and then hop on the sled and travel a few days more. We know her cabin by the red lantern hanging by the door. Okay. She gave us this map. It's uh, It's in Grand. Okay, like. I'm good. But it'll get us there. We just Was she five? Have to pick our path. Oh God, this is just. So you're gonna have to take the lead. It's a lot of responsibility looking out for a team, but I think you're ready for it. He's you ready to find Chomper's the lead dog. <laughs> yeah, the dog has never done this before. Too. Oh my God, the the team is so right. ill-behaved. Oh my sure God. We have what we need. We've got our team. This team is not gonna work together. Look at the half Barkley, of the team is already on Bodega, the ground. Iggy, Noodle. This guy's jumping around like crazy. That dog's got go. his head down. It's ready to like pack the bare cry. essentials to get us started. But we're gonna have to live off the land once we get to our cabin. So we might as well start training for that now too, right? Yeah, sure. This seems great. Two we have two meat. Of raw meat. That's it. Well, you pups can handle the uncooked raw and cold food, the kind we'll also find on the trail. But I'm gonna have to cook that up if I don't want to freeze my insides. Hypothermia is not something I'm really looking to try. We'll be able to set up camp once we get properly out on the trail. I scrounged up this old gun and a couple of three bullets. Three bullets? Just in case. You came on here with three bullets so we'll and you're gonna hunt? we do with what we have. We can use them to hunt or keep them around in case we need to protect ourselves. It is the oh wilderness after all. You know, bears, moose, wolves, that's, skunks. That's four things. You brought three oh, bullets. And most importantly, we've got one med pack. I should be able to it. bandage us up if something happens. You named four things about okay. three bullets. Well, I guess we should start. What do they say again? Mush on. Uh, mush on. That dog is laying down still and moving forward. Oh my God. Okay. Chopper is doing his thing. What do we have to do here? I'm not gonna do too much. I'm just gonna ride and look around, I think, right now. Now up here, we don't say left and right. We use ha for left and G for right. So let's go. So, uh, let's go. Looks like the river. Let's go. 
Uh, ha. Ha! I'm gonna avoid the river. Along the trail, you'll run into encounters. Encounters have risks, also bring rewards. You won't survive without exploring, but going into encounters costs hunger. This is your hunger meter. If your hunger meter is empty, you need to eat soon or risk losing your current run. Okay, so we're just gonna go. I don't think I have to worry about controlling anything. Even though it lets me control, I don't know if I have to worry about it a whole lot right now. Looks like we found some birch trees. Uh, do we want to stop and rip off Burke? No, mm, it's gone. We're good. We already have what we need. Let's go, Chopper. We're making good progress. All right, that costs us hunger to stop. So that's why I was thinking don't stop for the birch trees. Crossing a trail marker costs one energy. Okay. So our dogs have energy, our, our, our person is hunger. If you run, your run will end if you cross a trail marker when either your hunger meter or the dog's energy meter is empty. So we can't make sure, we have to make sure we get this tended to before we cross trail markers. Okay. And I don't see a trail marker for the moment. We'll see when we, I guess we'll see when we see one. This game is fantastic, first of all. The, the, the music's great. Hey, those look like birch up ahead. We could use those to start a fire. I guess, do we have, do we have starting fire stuff though? I thought we grabbed a starting fire. No, we don't need to do that. We don't have time for wood. We'll be okay. Let's move. I hope. Oh, now she's a little more nervous. Okay, there's the trail marker. I see it right there. If we get to a trail marker, we don't have food. Fork we'll be in trouble. We're two. Uh, I want to hit M for map. Uh, we want to go hog. Ah. We want to avoid the mountain, I think. But if we can go around the mountain, maybe. I don't know. I can't tell if that... Well, there's a mountain range ahead of us, so that's not good. But now we've got a situation here, it looks oh, like. Oh, A squirrel. No! Please don't see a chomper. I know you love them, but just try to ignore it. He sees oh, it. chomper. Oh, <laughs> chomper. See, oh, chomper decided. His life? Uh, he seems unperturbed by us, pups. Chomper, you, on the other hand, seem very perturbed. Is this your nemesis? Wait, did it just wink? Is this his, this is his nemesis? Okay, I can waste a bullet on a squirrel. We can have Chopper go for it. Or I can, I don't trust either, let's go. I speak wink, I'm gonna wink back. What does that mean? I'm intrigued. Since I can't speak squirrel with my mouth, I'll try with my eyes and wink. Did I just say that out loud? You are really starting to lose yourself out here. You've been here over a, not a day. Like that was just a waste of hunger, is what that was. Well, I worked up an appetite. Yeah. I'm gonna have to keep an eye on my hunger when I venture off. Yeah. Ready to go? So that was, I'm not wasting a bullet on, I'm not wasting a bullet on a squirrel, first of all. I will waste two bullets on a bear. Well, I wasted many bullets as it takes on a bear. Um, On getting food, like a deer or something like that, I would probably do two bullets. Oh, like, like that. Got a chance at a meal, pups. That I'll do. Hunt it. Okay. How do I actually hunt, though? Stay quiet. Just be calm. You've got this. Oh God! Did he get I it? Only injured it. Um. One more should do the trick. As long as I don't miss. Okay. I gotta shoot again. Yep, I'm doing it. Oh God, we really need this. You can't leave it injured. Yeah, that's you. You can do this. Okay, eat a, eat a, eat the whole breath. I missed. Oh, I got it. That's what we needed. I'll collect what I can and get back to the sled. We got how much food? Five. That was okay. Worth it. Some more food. Good, 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 good. We've got one bullet left. Yeah, At that's least not we've good. We've already got some food. All right, let's go. Well, we got hunger. Can we? Um, what do we do about this? Because we're low on hunger. Let's get back out there. Yeah, I don't know if we should have like stopped for camp or something like that. Doesn't seem like a good spot to stop for camp. But we have, we're passing the marker. Yes, camp. Yes. We all right. uh, set up a pretty good camp. We've got our meat all strung up to be out of reach of bears. And we yeah. can make a fire. It'll be nice to cook up some food or warm my bones. And of course, I can check on all of you. Okay, here you can eat meat. Fill your hunger meter, yes. You can use a dog food bowl to feed your dogs, filling their energy. Yes. 
And then you can sleep, restoring maximum capacity loss by being tired. All right, I want to feed the, the feed the dogs. Good time. Chow down, pups. Uh. If I give them three meat, they'll give them the half. Let's do it. Oh, I got a thing off my list. That's good. Feed the pups a full meal. Uh, should we light a fire and feed myself? Yes, fire I should. Would be nice. Okay, just a little birch bark. We only have a little bit of birch bark. Spark like that. and behold, fire. She did it. Okay, now cook a meat for yourself. I'm ready to cook some food. Uh, just one. That should be fine. Keep them out even is what I want, but I still have to do hunting and I only got one thing. Okay, so that's enough. And then pet chopper, yeah. Pet the dogs, pet all the puppies. You seem to really be coming into your own. Encouragement. Is it gonna cost me hunger to do this though? How long do I pet the dog? Though it would be nice oh, if you for as long derail as takes. our journey by chasing squirrels. Yeah, he'll understand that. Uh, I want to pet all the dogs. Oh, I have to choose which dog. I can only pet one pupper? No, I can pet more than one. Pet Barkley. Ready for pets, Barkley? I, I'm just gonna waste my entire evening petting all the pups. Pet Iggy. Let's get those pets in, buddy. Is there a time when they don't want pets? Is there a dog that doesn't want pets? What, who wouldn't? I love that Noodle is just a doodle. Hi, Noodle. I like that they all have different personalities, though. Just like dogs! This is feeling more exciting to you? Yeah, okay. Let's just get some scratches in. Right. I'm just here to... All right. As far as a dog petting simulator goes, this is pretty great. I mean, I think her trip... I think her whole premise here, her whole trip here is ill-advised. But as far as a dog petting simulator, top Good notch. Job, oh, not too much, too much, too much. Too much petting. I want to get the other dog. Uh, I got to get Bodega back there. What I got? Pet all the dogs! I'm gonna take this mitten off, but I fear frostbite. <laughs> Fantastic. Okay, let's get on the road then. Get back on the trail. trail. Ready yes. to go? It's not night yet. We should stop at night, but oh, we have to make another fire though at night. So I might not have birch to birch do that. All right. Fork in the They're road. still rolling around. Or two. Uh, look at the map. G. G. Going right this time. Because I'm trying to get around the mountain. See, the mountain range right in front of us. If I go off to that side, there's no mountain. I want to get between those two mountains is what I want to get. If I can. No squirrels this time, huh. please. Would you look at that? Oh, let's leave them alone. Will they find me something? I don't know. Maybe there's more they can find than the squirrel meat. Like, I'm not really interested in eating squirrel meat. Or using a bullet on a squirrel. Do I have any control here? Or do I need to control anything? I'm like still like leaning and stuff like I need to. That's far away, but it's here. What should we do? I can't, I can't, I can't get that. It's just gonna be a waste of time if I check it out. Let's leave. You're right, it's too far. Let's go. It's too far a shot, and I, it's a bigger animal, too. Like, I, I, I hit two shots on a deer before, and the five meat was nice, but we survived another round here. It's almost, it's, it's almost sunset here now. Oh, what is this guy? Slow down a bit, pups. What is that? What is that? I'm pretty sure that's a porcupine. Porcupine? Leave it. We don't need to mess with those spikes. Yeah. That's going to be a lot of uh, trouble. Well, the dogs are getting tired, though. I might be in trouble now. The dogs are getting tired now. Uh, we might be in trouble. I'm certain I read that owls are good. Yes, let's stop for that. Wait. They mean certain death. Yeah, all good things will Sounds come to those who wait. pretty good to me. <laughs> what do you pups think? Let's follow it! Oh, because I need to camp for the dogs anyway. That's what we needed, team! What do we think it'll lead us to? So we've some birch. It's a good okay. start. 
maybe watch the owl? I've never seen an owl this close before. So, what omen do you portend, huh? Well, you we can head up the down. Back. We haven't done anything yet. If I go back now, I'll have failed. Again. And Chomper is ready to run. He's hungry for competition, among other things. You're probably not going to eat through the gang line and run off into the woods, are you, buddy? Right? Right? Stop corn cop no, the gang no. line! Not to self. Double <laughs> wrap the gang line near Chomper. Oh, boy. This game is so funny. I like it. Oh, well, that's oh, good. Oh, was that a gift? Uh, inspect it. Owls will barf random things, I think. I think they're valuable. Yeah. You ate a bullet? That's a good thing you can pass pellets. The other method, well, yikes. Did I get the birch though too? Okay, I should have tried the birch back. though too. All right, we've got two bullets. I guess that's Let's good, but dog's gonna there. die though, I think. All right, let's, Let's can I press C to camp? As soon as we can. Okay, set up camp as soon as we can. Let's take a break. Yes. I need to get them some meat because we're going to go through another marker here this and I'm just going to feed them one round of food because that's all I have. I'm mean, this first food round time. here. So this yeah, does seem very roguelike ish, uh, roguelite ish. Um, we're going to have to hunt for more. Let's hit the road. Oh, should we camp? Should we sleep? Let's sleep. Might be time to get some rest. I'm sure my stomach will be grumbling by morning. Well, we don't have any food though. If we're stuck, we're going to be stuck. Well, should we go to sleep? Yes. The dogs did eat. They should get energy back. All right. Everyone feeling better? This is bad. Oh, this is bad. Cause now we're now we're going at night. Get back on the trail. All right. This Not is bad. Fun. I shouldn't have stopped. No, I think I screwed us up. Cause we're now we're going at night and we can't see anything, and the dogs can't see anything. And we're going through that marker, yeah, for sure. But now we're gonna have to hunt at night. Like I need no, to. I should have waited. I should have waited twelve hours. Up. We're not I stopped mean, at we're sunset. Still alive, and we're dogs getting closer die. to our new home. You know, just have to make it past some more trees. Our new home. Oh my snow. gosh. Probably some more snow. Yeah. And then we'll be there. This isn't happening for a first run like here. An incredible team. You even move as one. I am very impressed with your sled dog instincts. We might already be out of food, but. I'm sure we'll be fine. And it's yeah. been really nice not seeing any other people. It's just us in the world. I didn't expect to talk out loud this much, but we're really doing this. We're I, are we? I, I mean, I I'm becoming a musher, like a real one. I think Margot would be proud. What? I still can't believe she gave us her old cabin and, and gear. We're making progress. We should be oh, soon ran enough. by a river. Oh boy. We're on ice now. I think Chopper's Chomper's kind of all over the place. My dog's Chopper, my my real, my real life. So Chopper and Chomper are things that are very too similar. Um, I don't know if I should camp. I don't know if I can make a fire. I don't think I can give. I don't think I have any food to give them. But we're gonna make through one more marker, I think, then, before we run into problems. <laughs> There's an owl somewhere nearby. The owl's not gonna give us food. And if we stop, it's gonna cost us hunger. All right, let's try it. I don't know if it's gonna cost us dog Ooh. hunger or not. Ooh. Not an owl. Oh, not an owl. Oh. No! <sighs> Thanks, owl. I don't think I like moose or owls. I think I just have to risk the bad luck. Yeah, I think we got to take a med kit. Let's go. How do I do a med kit? How do I do a med kit? How do I do a med kit? Oh, I have to wait till camp, I think. I thought things were going to plan. I really did, but now I'm not so sure. Yeah, no, this is a bad idea. I really barely made it out okay. This might be too much for us, but. How do you know when something is actually for you? We've found the test we wanted, and we've made it through. So if this is for us, it'll work. It uh, it'll work out. It'll just work out. This is going to be bad, though, because we're, we're going to be out of hunger by the time we cross the next okay, marker. Pups? 
I've pushed you too hard, haven't I? It's okay. Yeah, you should have rested. We're done. You've done all you can. We're just gonna die out here? Your dog's running out of energy. Oh, we blew it. Ah, oh, dogs. A nightmare. <laughs> okay, well, at least I have an idea of what could happen to me out there. Oh, I didn't think it could be that hard. That's we have so good. Ahead. Are we ready for this? I know what to be wary of. As you play, you'll make interesting discoveries. At the end of the run, these will be added up to your journal. Your journal's packing list details the food, wood, bullets, and med packs you start each run with. Uh, as you make discoveries and become more prepared, you start future runs with more... Oh, okay, so as you play... You're not meant to make it through the first time. You just figure out what's wrong with, like, your picture. Like, obviously, like, three bullets doesn't make any sense. I said that. But as we play through, we'll get more things. I've never met a tree I didn't like. Felt small out there on the plains. There's just so much ice. Fed the pups a feast for dog kings. Love to pet my pups. I dissect an owl pellet again, but who hooted, the moose or the owl? Oh, I kind of dig it. So now we get four bullets. We get three food. Don't be afraid to explore, two wood. That's kind of cool. I like that. So now we have next run we play, it'll start over. We probably have to pick our pups still. And then we can have more bullets, more food to start with and be much more prepared to get further. That's a really great way of setting this up. It'll probably be a relatively short game. I'm thinking just as we do things and explore things, we'll check off more boxes and we'll get even more things. And then at some point we'll be so prepared mentally that we'll just accomplish it. We're gonna have a lot of nightmares before then, I think though. It's gonna take a little time. Anyways, I think that's a good spot to wrap this up. I hope it gives you a good taste of what to expect from this game. It seems really, really cool. Um, I'm really enjoying it. I might keep playing this one, maybe on a stream down the road. If you're not subscribed, haven't hit the notification, make sure to do that. I do stream every Tuesday, uh, Tuesday? Every, every, uh, every Friday and Saturday is when I stream, actually. 11.30 p.m. Central Time. Um, I do throw in some random streams during the week, though, sometimes, too. So just hit the subscribe uh, and notification icon so you can get notified of all that good stuff. You can join the Discord as well so you can get uh, updates there when I go live as well and uh, what the upcoming games and that kind of thing are going to be. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this look. And uh, if you did, leave a like and I'll be back for more next time. See you then.